What is going on, Thumb Thumbs? This is Sun Brother 2, also known as Brennan, bringing you guys our next episode of the TLTPG Pokemon Black 2 Randomize Here Nuzlocke. Uh, now, after our hour of power, we ended off with story, and I started to record this next episode. The only issue with that was, is as soon like two minutes into the episode, I realized my microphone wasn't recording, so thank God we didn't go any further, and I noticed it early on. But we are here now in Himalau City to go and continue uh, around the Giant Chasm and actually go towards Victory Road, where we will eventually be taking on the Pokemon League. Let's go ahead and get a tick, uh, a tick, a quick team <laughs> recap for you guys. Um, we're gonna go ahead and start off with Terra, our level 55 Tor Terra, rocking out with the Crit Claw because she's not that fast. Has Razor Leaf, Stone Edge, Crunch, and Earthquake. Next up, we have Bobby, our uh, Scrafty, holding the leftovers, rocking out with Brick Break, Crunch, Superpower, and High Jump Kick. Up next, we have Hype, the Rayquaza, uh, rocking out with Nasty Plot, the Power Up Surf, and Hyper Voice. Also has Outrage for her General Stab. Up next we have Surge, our Raichu holding the Magnet uh, to power up moves like Thunderbolt and Volt Tackle. Also has Fly and Heart Stamp. Then we have Decahedron, who is now holding the Burn Drive finally to make that to turn that Techno Blast into a Fire type move. Right, is rocking out with Signal Beam, uh, Thunderbolt, and Tri Attack as well. And last but not least, we have Metagross, our Professor X, uh, rocking out with Zen Headbutt, Bullet Punch, Hammer Arm, and Meteor Mash, and is holding that King's Rock to get them flinches on the Zen. Headbutt. So that is our team, you guys, as you do see them hopping around at the bottom. We are going to go ahead, continue on, uh, and hopefully we will be able to make good progress today. I, I am really hoping that we make good progress. Because all that stuff with the story, you know, my voice is finally healed up. Well, we, should, we should be able to go ahead and just have a nice, fun adventure. Have a nice, fun adventure. Do I have any repels? Do I have any super ripples? I do. I have 45. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. I sold all my uh, relics, and so we are living in the money. That is right. I totally forgot about that. All right. After I stop hitting into walls, we should be able to continue on. Giant Chasm, which is where we were before. I still don't have strength. Yes, please. And do we want to go out this way? I think we should go out this way. Yeah, I think this is the way we want to go. Ooh, Dragon Fang! Yo, that might actually be good to put on a uh, hype. But is this a new route for us? Route 13. Where is Route 13 here? I think we've gotten an encounter on Route 13, where we were before- Whoa, my phone just flew up. Uh, I'm not sure if that was Giant Chasm, we will see in just a second, however. We- Oh, now I know, yeah, we, we did have an encounter on Route 13, but is this still Giant Chasm? Yeah, this is still Giant Chasm, so unfortunately we don't get a new encounter here. Yes. See, that's Giant Chasm there, so... This is the wrong way to go. Hmm. Where do we go? Let's see, outside of Giant Chasm, down there is where we went before. So do we go up and around? Here we go. Wait, this... Ah, we need strength. Okay. And we are on Route 23, which is definitely a new encounter for us. Um, we are gonna go ahead and start checking things out. Look, this music, by the way, is actually kind of hype. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll repel for a little bit more. Ooh. You think a cut tree is gonna stop us? We're gonna surf on our giant green dragon. Wise glasses. I don't know what. Does that up um, special attacking moves? Like, isn't that like the, uh, the Macho Brace or something? I can't remember exactly. But okay, let's get into some battles. Who are we leading with? We're leading with Terra, which I don't think I want to do. I might have to switch her out. Has one Pokemon, and it's a Maractus. We should be good here. Maractus can't really do... Level 57! Okay, we are under-leveled here. 
Pedal dance. Crunch knocks it out. We're good. Okay, so Terra's level 56 now. Let's let's see, where can I quickly move things around? This should be good. I'm gonna start I'm gonna slowly start getting everyone up to level 55 before I start messing around with everything else. Uh because we're we are under leveled and I'm quite surprised there. Okay, this guy wants to battle, and Decahedron is gonna be putting in work now. As we go up against a Chikorita. Level 57, yes, but you know, we saw the burn drive. Let's go ahead and take an old blast just to see what it does. Boom. The thing that's also nice with Techno Blast is we could take the any drive off of it and give it give Decahedron any other kind of um any other kind of item because Techno Blast at that at that point would be normal type and we'd be able to get a stab boost on it, which would be really cool. But for now, this is just for general coverage, just because we don't have a fire type. But Ardos comes in. We're gonna go ahead and get the knockout there as well. Super nice and lovely. As this hiker is here looking to battle people, I'll battle you, bro. Let's go ahead and get going. Oddish. I'm just gonna try attack. Spinarak. Oh gosh, please. Where's the where's the challenge? Where's the challenge with these guys? And we still need an encounter on this route. So I think there's some grass above us here. If I recall, if, I, if that's what I remember seeing. A bomb, which would be actually fun to use, I'm not gonna lie. Mammal swine, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go ahead and swap into Bobby. And we will just go ahead and brick brick. Goes for the mist. I don't follow. Goes for the earthquake against us. That does crazy damage. I gotta be careful, because these guys do out-level us. Holy cow. Okay, let's go ahead and quickly heal up here. There we go. Terra will heal you up too. Okay, and there should be grass over this bridge. Yeah, so let me run out. This does not count as our first encounter, because the Amoongus are always going to be Amoongus, so that does, this does not count. This does not count. Level 56, though, holy cow, I might want this. No, we're going to go ahead and run, actually. We're going to go ahead and run. Uh, we're going to run off this... Uh, Definitely gonna run off this re re repel. So our first encounter on this route is going to be worst bird ever. Okay, um, let's go ahead, try attack it. Let's see a little bit of damage to it. Maybe we can get the freeze. Who knows? Or it just dies. Decahedron's an absolute beast. Well, there goes our encounter. Um, I didn't even like it anyway. What could we have gotten? Hold on. What could we have gotten? Ah! Oh! And we got the shitbird? Oh, God. Oh, guys. Come on. I'll battle you really quick. I gotta get some anger off of my back. Let's do this. Sudobudo. Hammer arm. Okay. But your speed fell. We outspeed. Tri attack comes in with a knockout. Ugh. I missed your mime. That would have been cool. 
Uh, sorry guys, I'm really tired. Lax incense, okay. Is there anything over here? Something I can't get to, okay. This guy really blocked my path, okay. Out of every Pokemon we could have gotten here, we got a pheasant. We got an pheasant when we could have had a Deoxys. You're a trainer, aren't you? I f should have figured we could have had a pheasant. We could have had a Bisharp. We could have had a Mr. Mime. I would have preferred Mr. Mine way more than freaking. Oh God, I'm so sad now. That just makes me sad. You gonna paralyze me? Don't do this. Don't do this. Thank you. Don't do this, come on! Come on! Thank you! Holy cow. Cool. Get out of my way. TM2, which would have been Dragon Claw. Okay, let's go ahead and get out of here. We have Ogatat, Ogato. <sighs> Are you kidding me? And we got the worst bird possible! These could have been our encounters, ladies and gentlemen, but the game decided, no, we want to give him an Unpheasant. I haven't even seen an Unpheasant since! That's just bull. That is bull. Loney. This red's actually really big. I don't know where I'm going. <sighs> really? Really? Oh, did we make it? We made it! So that's where Victory Road is, but I'm, I I kind of want to, like, kind of want to, like, explore. Like, what's over here? Nothing. But, like, that's a Haxorus. What's up, my dude? Come here. That man has a Haxorus. TM35 Flame Wheel. That's cool. What could we have gotten in this grass? Because this is double grass, isn't it? Fish Sharps, okay. Oh god! No! That crit mattered so much. That crit mattered. 
Are you serious? I can't have nice things, you guys. I really can't. That sucks. Um, Takahiji was putting in all the work! You know, I hate Bisharp now. Bisharp can just go die in a hole. Stop! Yeah, no more, no more exploring for us. Um, no more exploring, please. Uh, we're gonna get the hell out of here, and now I have to train up a whole nother Mon. That just pisses me off. We'll heal up Surge. We'll leave with Bobby. Ah, okay, moving on, moving on. It'll be okay. Because we're in Victory Road now, which means we get an encounter. And we get our final encounter for this Nuzlocke, which is kind of sad to think, but, you know, this, this Nuzlocke is... Long time overdue. Please let there be a Pokemon Center at the bottom, at least. Can can there at least be that? It's N! You came. The Pokemon League is just past Victory Road. Pokemon battles do nothing more than hurt Pokemon. That's how I understood it, and that's why I hated battles. But it's not that simple. Pokemon battles decide winners and losers, it's true, yet they do so much more. Your Pokemon, you, your opponents, and their Pokemon. Everyone can see that what wonderful things the others can, can uh, change to contribute. That's right, accepting different ideas, different beings, changes the world. Like a chemical reaction. Pokemon battles are like a catalyst, a small component that leads to big changes. My friend Zekron, Zekron taught me that. And it's the formula I've derived from traveling the world. I want you to think for yourself and what it means. Here, take this with you. The new Victory Road has areas that are only accessible with waterfall. Well! Waterfall. Yes. If it's, if it's your Pokemon and you, you'll get past the Pokemon League and recognize your own ideals. That's what I see in store for you. Alright, you guys. So we just got waterfall. Oh, that's the badges! That's awesome! So we can't continue without the other ones. I didn't even- I totally forgot this was a thing! Yo, that's cool! That's- that's really, really super sick. I'm not gonna lie. Yo! I think that was a little much, but okay. Things falling like Wal Maria. Oh, thank you, Pokemon Center! Alright, so let's heal up our Pokemon. Talk to the people here really quick. We are going to deposit, unfortunately, Decahedron. I hate Bisharp. I'm sorry, Decahedron. I'm I really am. Okay, um, What do we, who do we add here? Let me go. Oh, look at this death box that we lost. Mer we had Kimimaru, Fiji, Kylie, Zoroark, Annie, oh, Annie, and Decahedron. Alright, you guys. So we need a waterfall user for sure. So that makes me want to lean towards uh, labels, our slow king. Um, the only issue is, is that we'd have a really nice weakness to bug and dark with uh, Metagross there as well, or just at least Dark. 
Anyone else can learn Waterfall? Yo, we have Cresselia, Dark Bright, Ampharos here. Oh my god. Cobalion. Oh my god. I'm just like wondering, like, should we change the team up a little bit? I mean, we do have Azuril, who is Jolly Huge Power. It is Jolly Huge Power, and Waterfall is a wonderful special type move, a uh, physical type move. I think I just have to train it. That's the only issue. Um, let me look at something really quick. Oh, my back. I am going to look up what it takes to uh, evolve an Azuril into a Meryl. Because I know Az Azuril, I mean, Meryl into Azumarill is like level 18. Um. Cerebi. Pokedex, uh, Johto, looks like it is by friendship for Azuril and Tamaril, which could take a while, unfortunately. Um, can Azuril even learn Waterfall for the time being? Looks like it can. It can learn a waterfall, so... Having the uh, water type would be really nice on our team. Is there anyone else I feel like we should switch out? So we'll definitely add, um, Sad Face, our Azuril, Jolly Huge Power, that'll be putting in work. Um, looking at our team, you know. Physical, 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 special, no, physical. Do I want to mix it up and take hype off and put someone else on? Who would we put on though? That's the thing. Who do we put on? We uh we don't have a we have a water type now. We have fighting dark, steel psychic, grass ground, water electric. So, we don't need you. We don't need you. Ghost flying would be kind of cool. Steel psychic that replaces both of them. Normal flying, we could always put Starscream on the team. Uh, we have Darkrai. Shield on. We could put Fungus. We could put Fungus on there. Um, Truffles can evolve. I don't know. Well, actually, you know what? Let, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, Azuril is on the team, yes. Uh, but let's go ahead and... Because we have time. We have time in this episode. Uh, we're going to go into Victory Road really quick. And we are going to see what uh, our last encounter is. And we will decide from there. Which I like. I think there's an item there. Hold on. Maybe not. Maybe so. Hold on. Prism scale. Okay, cool. Can I be let in, please? Water gem. How do I get down there? Grip Claw, that doesn't do anything. OK, 
Okay, there's that side. What about on this side? Okay. So let's quickly go into Victory Road. See if, um... I don't remember this Victory Road. Can we even run into any Pokemon? Okay, so our final encounter is going to be... Poliwhirl! Politoed is with King's Rock, which we do have a King's Rock. Um, I think we would just have to level it up with the King's Rock, so Politoed is not a bad answer as well. So let's go ahead and capture this thing really quick. So we got Poliwhirl. So we will name you... It's like we could... The thing is, we could do a Poliwrath or a Poliwhirl. I mean, or a Politoad. I'm gonna call him Mickey, cause he's like Mickey Mouse with those gloves. Okay, let's see what else we could have gotten in here. Hold on. Okay, Polywhirl. Polywhirl. Let me out! Let me out, 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 right now, let me out, right now! Oh my god, belly drum! Wait, does our Poliwhirl have belly drum? Please tell me our Poliwhirl has belly drum. Okay. Poliwhirl is right here. Quirky nature, which what does that do? Is neutral, but he does have belly drum. <gasps> so we could try for the belly drum Azumarill, or the belly drum um, Poliwrath. The only issue with that is with Poliwrath, we have already got a fighting type in Bobby. And looking at stats, what I mean is a physical. A physical polytoad won't be a bad thing, right? Let me look at this. Let me look at this. Um. thing is it's like what moves can I teach this Poliwhirl? What moves can I teach both of them? Now Waterfall has to happen. Waterfall has to happen. And both of those are, both of them would love the stab. I'm just gonna set uh, Terra any here really quick. Um, and we're gonna take... No, I'm not gonna waste your guys' time anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and decide, make this decision off screen. I'm gonna go ahead and grind. Get us ready for Victory Road as we do our work or make our way through because we are right at that 30 minute mark. But I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. If you have enjoyed this episode, definitely leave a like and comment down below. Uh, who do you think I should have chosen? Uh, I probably won't see it uh, because I'm bulk recording, but let me know who you guys think I should have chosen to add to the squad. But with that, I am, I think I'm going to get out of here as soon, as soon as I can find my mouse. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. So thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Sunbirthy2, and I'll see you in the next one.